Carry on. <laughs> <laughs> Start from the beginning. You're such a dick. Okay. <laughs> Start from the beginning. Shush. Okay. Also, it's, I don't think it's fairy tales, so... What's that? Shush. Okay, this is the Jolly Rancher's story. Nothing tops the Jolly Rancher story. Steve and his girlfriend Samantha went off to college in August. She went to Florida State, and he went to Penn. So, she decides to fly to PA to visit him. He was really happy to see her, so he decided to give her some oral action. He had done this numerous times before and always enjoyed doing it. But for some reason, this time, she smelled really horrible, and she tasted even worse. He didn't want to offend her though, because he hadn't seen her in months. So he put a Jolly Rancher in his mouth to cover it up, even though it didn't really do very much to help. In the course of eating her out, he accidentally pushed the candy inside of her, and stuck a finger in to grab it out. He took it out, put it back into his mouth, and bit it. Only, oh, it wasn't the Jolly Rancher. It was a nodule of gonorrhea. As oh in the master like structure that gonorrhea makes, filled with diseased pus, it was the size of the fucking Jolly Rancher, and the poor guy bit into it. I guess it was really dark in the room. I guess he sort of freaked out and started vomiting all over the place when it exploded in his mouth. He demanded to know what was going on. Turns out she had cheated on him at a club like in the first week of college and fucked some random guy and the stupid bitch had no clue what was wrong with her. She noticed the strange smell though. So now Steve is freaking out that he has gonorrhea of the mouth and god knows what else. And that is the story of the Jolly Ranchers. <laughs> That You've got to do that more. This is the most thing I have ever heard this is in the my best life. Thing I've ever I actually heard. had to mute myself halfway through that because it was just like, I was gagging <laughs> This shit bit. is going on YouTube. I was gagging. 